Well, when it comes to our overall forecast, we are kind of stuck dealing with this wildfire smoke, and it has lowered our air quality here in Spokane and just south of town to the point that it is unhealthy for those with I would say lung disease, heart disease, or any kind of breathing ailment. Asthma, throw that in there, that kind of thing. Allergies, yes, that's one of them. Record heat eventually moves in, and that should help clean out our air, but next week looks cooler and just a little bit wetter as we kick it off. Right now we sit at a 102 in terms of AQI. That puts us in that unhealthy for sensitive groups, even if barely. Now, tonight we likely stay there. And then tomorrow, it looks like we start our slow, steady improvement. And it's all because of the way this all sets up. So it's pretty bad just south of us. It's pretty good off to the north. And it all is about where that smoke is streaming in, we'll say. But overall, we are expecting things to remain, I would say, below good in terms of air quality through Saturday morning. So we have those air quality alerts in effect for northern and eastern Washington and much of western Montana. And when it comes to the smoke, you can see it. It's on the satellite imagery, but the good news is it's starting to creep up. So if you're in places like Portland or even I would say Hood River and starting to make its way toward Yakima, the better air is slowly moving in. So our line is starting to shift. So you can see we're wrapping all this smoke around, but now you can almost just pick out that line and start to push it away. So things are starting to improve in some areas. For us, not just yet. In fact, it looks like it takes a little bit longer. I would say not until tomorrow do we start seeing those improvements and not until we really watch those temperatures soar do we start to really get the benefits of that cleaner air coming in from, believe it or not, California and Oregon. But yes, we eventually get a cool down. And that cool down looks to arrive kind of early next week and it pulls in air from over the Pacific. It's cooler. The Pacific is always cooler. So for us, that brings welcome relief. So tomorrow, Saturday, likely record high territory. I told you all week I was likely going to trim back that 90 on Saturday. I did. I just didn't have it in me to leave it. Scattered thunderstorms Sunday. And then next week, look at next week. Highs near 70, lows in the upper 40s. It's about as perfect as it gets in my book. Yeah, it is. And 89, 90, I mean, either way, it's going to be hot. Yes. So.